Hey what's good, I'm Sadia and in today's video I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing the Xbox Go Chameleon. I previously reviewed the Xbox Go AI Sports Gimbal which was a really great product but this looks even better, especially when, when you want to fully let the tech do all of the work for you. No hand holding whatsoever. The box as you can see here is nicely designed. I like the packaging and I don't know about you but I really do appreciate a good box. First impressions and all that. The back shows you what you get in the box and as you can see here this is compatible with both iOS and Android smartphones. Turn it to its side and you get a glimpse of the key features which are essentially the Chameleon's key selling points. And they proudly showcase the fact that the Chameleon was the red dot winner of 2024. Champion? Alright let's get the Chameleon out. A pretty airtight box and there it is. These look really sleek in matte grey or should I say lava graphite as the box stated. You can get it in pearl grey or lemon green as well. So this is the RC1 remote control which has a directional pad to control the camera direction, a confirmation button, a power button and a function button to switch between the different modes. It's got a nice soft rubber feel to it. It takes a CR2032 battery and the box also comes with a USB-C cable and of course the Chameleon itself, if I can get it out. It's nice and snug in there. It's fairly weighty but it's not heavy at all. The bottom has the quarter inch thread to mount on a tripod. The side here displaying the export logo is a light which represents the Bluetooth status. A steady light means it's connected and a slow flashing light means Bluetooth isn't connected. You've got the 120 degrees AI lens right here at the front and at the top is the phone holder clamp which tightens by twisting right here. The box also comes with an operation guide which warns you to only twist at the base to prevent damaging the chameleon and of course a user manual which covers basically everything you need to get started. And that's the unboxing done. Before I put it to the test, let me just charge it. Only two lights are steady which tells me it's got a 50% charge already. Alright, so having had this for a few weeks now, I can say that it's a game changer for sports filming. The AR tracking is really really good. It lets you be completely hands free so you can actually enjoy the game whilst it's doing all of the capturing for you. I love that. You don't even have to keep an eye on it because the AI tech in this knows what it's doing. Think of it like your very own cameraman. Except it's your very own free cameraman. The good thing about it is that it covers a variety of sports. From football, to basketball, to hockey, to rugby and so much more. The tracking is very accurate and it uses re-identification tech to identify and follow players by their appearance, body shape and the number on their shirt. It's perfect for following a specific player or the entire team. Not only that but it also has a follow me mode which uses AI tracking to track you which is really useful especially when you're filming by yourself. You can activate this by simply raising your hand and as long as you're in the frame the follow me mode will be activated. Cool, huh? The Xbox Go, which I mentioned earlier, is available on iOS and Android and it lets you edit the videos, but you can also use it to live stream the game, which I think is super handy. There's no subscription to pay on the app, it's completely free and gives you 20 gig of free cloud storage. The Xbox Go gimbal was impressive, but the Chameleon has taken it to another level. There's nothing like it, it's like the one and only AI product that can track and record sports games. If it's something that you're interested in then be sure to hit my referral link and use my exclusive discount code which is in the description below. I hope you found this video helpful and thanks for watching. Peace.